think we are about ready to go. Everything's set up and ready to go. More or less. <laughs> Thumbs down. Just suck on my phone. Alright. So, what are you in the mood to play? <clears throat> Let me swap it over. Take it away, operator. Network 5. We got past the door blocking her way that required 40 mega chips. Only to find out there was a door that required all standard chips. After taking the time to gather them all, made it to Nebula Area 5 to get past a liberation mission obtaining Anubis for our efforts. After getting past that, we find out more roadblocks exist requiring requiring to get records on her six teammates. And well, the plan, here's the thing, we have options on what to do. Sorry. <coughs> so we have a few options. We could go after our six teammates and get records on them, basically s rank them. So we can open the doors in Nebula Area 6 and continue on with that section. There are other doors in Nebula Area 4 that we could try to open. One of them requires getting every uh, program advance. Another one requires every mega chip, which one of them requires us getting all, all of the program advances. So, hmm, on, give me a sec. I am going to pull up the list of chips because I'm kind of leaning towards program advances, honestly. This is kind of what I'm leaning towards. Uh, just kind of work on this here and there. Working on this can probably help us work on this in here. I'm also thinking maybe get bug fragments so we could get we could get the Giga Chip and then also work on getting Poltergeist. That's another option. Do we have? We have a single lock enemy. How about we go to Nebula Area 3. Let's grind for bug fragments with the lock enemy. It, no, wait, was it? It might have been 2. Was it Nebula Area 2? I forget specifically which Nebula area it was. It was either two, three, or four, but it was one with the two Scully enemies. Because that one wasn't that bad. I'm going to untrap. Okay. With the net dealer. the net dealer we are either we either need to use the money for our HP memories or we're using the money to buy chips that can help us with program advances so I think maybe I should save the money a bit man I feel like ever since like battle network battle network 4 money has been kind of tough to gather or you require a lot of money just in general and the game gi the games give you a similar amount. You just need a lot more. I don't know which one is the answer, but either way, I just felt like after Battle Network three, you know, money has been a, a lot harder to get in large quantities. This is an okay fight, actually. However. Actually, this is not that bad of a fight. I can 
make this work. Hold on. Yeah, hold on, hold on. We want Shadow Soul. We have Shadow Souls so we can avoid the poison. Um, we can go with Number Soul if we want, but you know what? If I'm gonna go that route, I want to get rid of the poison tiles. I actually have no clue if I should use Slowly. Let's not. So let's play it safe. Hold on. I don't mind getting it. I actually don't mind. Okay. Oh, as much as I would love to use Chaos Lord, that would break the things for me. Shining Man will cover it. We got three buck frags. And you know what? This is not a bad one. Lock enemy. And if it's like Battle Network 4, it's looking for the specific formation that we just fought. Not enemy type. So we should be able to get that fight again. Okay. Let's go Tomahawk. So we can uh, get rid of the poison. Get away with the number soul, which bumps both of these up to 150. Okay. Or just a single one will work too. Buck practice. Every time, make a save. We are going to keep this going until the lock enemy runs out. If we don't get the same formation, set the save. Save every time you get bug practice. This is probably a decent way to get money as well, but right now we need the points. <clears throat> Shadow Soul. Let's start with my single fire hit. Nice gauge. Shark shark going. That. All right. Django. Don't need that. Three solos will be enough. That is Zenny. As much as I would want to keep that, I need bug fragments. I need bug fragments more than I need money. Carefully. There we go. More buck fragments. Yeah, 
This is, I guess this is the best way to do it. So I guess area one's not that bad. I guess as long as you're in nebula area. Like, you could find some good mystery data. Right now, the benefit of Nebula areas is that there is no area in here that has an enemy. So we don't need to worry about fighting anyone. Okay. This is... Okay. In this case, I think we could get away with using Aqua only because the enemy's in the back. It will not move from the back. We'll have anti-damage just because... Uh, do we have something else? I guess Aqua World will do. This one, nope, I already have a few of those. I don't need more. I don't need Duo's Fist. I don't need more of the Fist of Justice. Right. Another attempt. We could go with... This isn't that great. I guess we'll go with Django. Use it on the Scully. That shouldn't destroy the. Yeah, it doesn't destroy the green mystery. Okay. Kind of lucked out there. Yeah, we're just going to use the Mega Buster. I'm not risking that. Alright. I guess what we'll have to do then is Gully? Oh, and we have Fire Hit. Yeah, we're gonna have to deal with Poison. It's okay. okay. I'd rather deal with the Poison just for a little bit just to get this win. Fragments? 90. Just a few more fights and we get the Giga Chip. We will have to do more of these sets. But as far as I can tell, this is the best way we can get uh, Bug Fragments. I'm gonna need to buy another lock enemy now that I think about it. Start with that. Fire hit, fast gauge, charge shot. Okay. 
Shadow Man, just to weaken. Okay. Gonna have to make a Buster. Once we get, I think it's Bug Charge, we could go to Nebula 2 and open the door. I'm not sure what's in there, though, but we could do that. As much as I should at least get two things of Zenny to replenish a lock enemy, I really need both things. No way I can safely make this dance. It will not be. It will probably destroy the burning mystery data if I do that. And then. No, well, we could probably just use. Yeah, we have. The problem is, we have options on what we can do at the moment. And it makes it very difficult to make a decision. Might as well use Muramasa. Get the first hit. Oh, it's an evil chip. It's back to. It's still an evil chip. You can't actually use it. Dang it. Okay. It's literally just meant to be a program advance. Unless you're evil, which I am not. I'm a good boy. <laughs> Mega Man's a good Christian boy. He would do nothing evil. You can see it reflected by his color palette. Okay. Now that I know that that doesn't work. Uh, let's go with Tomahawk, fast gauge, And that means I can't use Anubis either, now I'm thinking about it. I should look up the program advance and see how much uh, and take a look at how much bodyguard actually hits for because it's 70 damage per hit 
and I'm not sure if it's going to be that worth it anymore. I mean, battle number two and three, bodyguard was the strategy. <laughs> I don't know about now, honestly. Definitely not in battle number four. They definitely made it. Bodyguard's way too good. Okay, we have two stories. Okay, this is not the fight, but we'll take it. Well, hold on. We actually can't win this. There's no way I can hit the skull, uh, the Scully enemy. Without, yeah, nope, there's no way. I can't do that fight. Shurikens weighed rain down at seven, or uh, no, ten shurikens. Seventy damage. It would be seven hundred damage though. That's still pretty good. Seven hundred damage. I'll, you know what? Okay, it's still probably worth it. May not be as good as how it used to be, but seven hundred damage is way better than some of my other. Of course, that's if the first hit actually connects, and if the enemy doesn't have super armor. This, it's a one hit kill. Full cuss? I don't need full cuss. I, I really don't. I'm still at 93 bug fragments. Okay. Let's try it again. I can either go with fire hit. Or what we could do is... Um... Hectoball work. Yay, Bug Fragments. I need two more fights for bug, with Bug Fragments. Just kind of, we're just kind of focused on cleanup. It's gonna be a bit before we can move on to the work on Nebula Area 6 stuff. Fist of Justice. We don't need that. We already got it. We got it for free. Nope, not this fight. Go. 
found it again. I can't guarantee anti-damage is gonna hit me slowly. set of buff fragments. Okay. Um, I guess I have the Shadow Soul. I can't safely use Leader Raid. So I think it'll be best to go with this. And we are not going to use Leader Raid. This won't be enough to KO, but all of these will. There we go. It's done. Bug fragment? No. Fist of Justice. I don't know why they let you get multiple Fists of Justice like this. I guess you can put multiples in your folder, I guess. I don't know why you would do that. I mean, I guess you could trade it over to someone. Like, that's starting out the game and just give them a piece of justice right away. I could see myself doing some bug frag grinding like this off screen. I could see myself doing that. Because I'm going to need a lot of bug frags. Fire hit. One Scully, but Cactiball works good, honestly. Cactiball's fine. Full cast, no. I should probably look up how many bug frags I'm gonna need in total after Poltergeist and start counting them up. Maybe if I go into those areas, I'll uh, keep track. Tomahawk. Um, no, not Shadow Man. We'll, we'll Scully. No, Fists of Justice. We don't need that. This is the bug frag grinding. Shot, kind of know the drill. 
Fragments! Yay! <laughs> 102. Alright, at this point, we're gonna keep this going until Lock Enemy runs out. However, and Lock Enemy just ran out. Never mind. Okay. We need to go to Undernet 2. Zenny grinding or bug frag grinding. That's the route. Actually, this is not a bad fight either. This right here is not that bad. Oh, I could I could have probably told man. I didn't even mean to anti-damage. Sanctuary. It's totally gonna work. It's gonna save you in the long run. It's gonna save the one in the back for a little while. This is actually not a bad one to fight either. Leader, right? We can use leader, right? Yeah, there we go. I'll I'll keep that three thousand zenny. So I think if you're gonna do like bug frag grinding like that, and you only have like one lock enemy, what I might suggest is get two. Zenny rewards because I think lock enemies cost uh, they cost 6,000 Zenny, so get two Zenny rewards and then spend the rest of the time getting uh, uh, bug friends. So try for this. Sanctuary? Okay. A little bit extra zenny, not bad. Okay, bug frag trigger. We got bug charge. There we go. Now, I am going to pull up the calculator. 26 plus 30 plus that right there is already 146 bug frags. All this right here is 146. If you want to get everything. Making that save, we got three big chips. Let's make a run to Nebula area and open the door. Because we can do that now. Make a trip to Nebula Area f uh, 4. Yeah, 4. Uh, 
probably should be fighting some things, because I don't know what programs I need. When, when we actually do program advanced stuff, I'm gonna... Yeah. We're gonna be opening and closing doors, that's for sure. We'll probably just... It'll be easier to just close the... The one door. Actually, you know what? Uh... When we open the bug frag door, or the, the giga chip door, my bad, I'll take a look at what program advances I need and see if any of them are the level 2 variants. And if so, then, then I'll just close the door and we'll work on the level 2 variants of the program advances. I can't really do that. Again, let's go open that door. I don't know what's in there, but it might help. Again, I can't really do much about this, can I? I mean, I could do something. I don't know if I can do it or if it's constructed. Okay. Other guy's gonna wake up, and then I can shadow man him. Well, that stuns him. And uh, no, I don't have any way to. I have nothing. To do. Yeah, I tried. My current folder doesn't really work with that enemy formation. Not the best. Okay. Because we'll be in Nebula Order 4, we can figure out we'll be right next to the door. We could close it. Oh no, I can't run. Woe is me. I don't want to deal with the poison tiles. You got frustrating. Like, nah, you're done. You're gonna cause poison. Let me run. Thank you. I don't want to do that fight. We'll grab the green. Go and grab the green. Oh, I went the wrong way for it. Oh, well, I don't care. <laughs> I'm not that. I got it confused with this section right here. Area three. I should check the rewards for the liberation missions just in case there's like a chip we can get but i don't think there is i think we kind of got the rewards that are the the good rewards muramasa anubis blackwing we kind of already got them and i don't know if there's another reward that's worth it Was right there. Well then, um, it's the best way to do this. Not these two, that's for sure. Um, Shadow Soul, Scully. I don't care. This is 
not the worst. This is not the worst. It, it could be far worse. This is not an ideal one though. I'd rather have it. to Nebula 4. And right over here. No, not that one. Oh, it's up and around. Okay, I see. Power's been shown. And we get an HP memory. Okay, you know what? I'll take it. So with that in mind, let's look up program bases. What can I do? What do I need? We need Giga Cannon 2 and 3. However, I think to get those chips, we just need to buy them. Or green mystery data. We'll come through green mystery data. Yeah, so a lot of green mystery data for high cannon. Blue mystery data, side lab area, level 2 green mystery data, chip order system, end area, level 2 green mystery data. We'll come to, yeah. Oh. Hmm. Okay. I'm not worried about that. Okay. Infinite Vulcan 2 and 3. Scilab, level 1, green mystery data, chip order, or in area 3, level 1, green mystery data, and area 1, level 1, green mystery data, or orient in area 2, okay, yeah, so we're fine there, level 3, there's a net dealer for one of them, level 1, green mystery data, green mystery data, how to feel, boxer 3, we could get that later, if we don't have, we don't have it already, but we could grab it later. Because once we put everything back to level 3, I can get it. I just want to get focus on the earlier variants. Ah, uh, the wide shots. Okay. okay. Let's take a look at the wide shots. How do I... I thought I had this. How do I get now? Level 1, rank 9, ship pop... Ship pop 1... Green mystery data. So there's two ways of getting it. Either it either means we change it to level one, or we just go to we go get green mystery data and ship comp one. Okay. Wide shot two. We can either do end area two level three green mystery data, which I could do that now. Or we fight the level two variants. Okay. One shot three. We have to fight the EX variants and get a higher rank. We have to. So it looks like all of these I could do in the level three variants of the viruses. Shake Parade. I know I don't have any of these actually unlocked. So, where is it? Where are the chips? Got some gold now. Here we go. Okay. We need H. Give me a 
second. a level one green mystery game or we fight the enemies either way we need to swap it down to level one okay swap it down to level one so we'll see we either fight the level we have to fight the level two variants no matter what that's the only way okay and then in this case uh, we have to fight the level 3 variants, or one of them we can buy the chips uh, from the Gatesby shop. Well, for one, we already know I need to fight the level 2 variants of Shakey's. So, I could close the door. I already know that. How would that Close this door. I already know I need to close it. So because of that, I only have C, so we need E and D, which we, which means we either need to fight we need to fight both variants, both the normal and the EX. Or there's a chance we can get both of them from the EX. Okay. Gonna work on Shake Parade too. And then we have all three cactus dances. Uh, Hyper First, Life Sword. I need Great Yo-Yo. I know I'm missing one. Green mystery data. Uh, green mystery data. Green mystery data. Level one. Okay. We'll grind for those later. Yo yo. Pit hockey. I already done. We can maybe set up poison pharaoh. I need to look at. We have two other chips. We have cosmo. Oh, it's cosmo prison. Okay. Enemies on the same row are hit nine times. Wait. Asteroids up from all columns. On all columns in front of them. Enemies on the same row are hit nine times. All other rows are hit six times. Mm -hmm. Does it sound that great? And, uh... Okay, I think there's uh, two more we can actually pull off right now. Big noise. I gotta check for time bomb. And bodyguard. I don't know if we can pull off Pile Driver yet. Okay, so it's right now it dies since people are leaving the game. Okay. Is it really gonna die, Hot Corn Dog? I don't know if it really is. It never does. But how's it going? I know late reply, but I was looking at I was looking at things. Uh, okay. You know what? I'm gonna buy a lock enemy. I have a feeling I'm gonna need it. Traps, I guess, while I'm at it. And what's 
been going on. Anything I could buy in here. Winder. So two. So we'll get fast gauge. Creation. No, nothing. Nothing new from this one. But I can use the ship service. I think that one's actually at one of the vendors. So I'm gonna need him somewhere else. Oh, I actually don't have. Okay, actually, I need. I need this. I got one of them. I'm gonna need another one. Good thing we're at the level two section, so now I'm gonna need to figure out how to get another F code. I didn't realize I didn't have that one. That's not needed. I already have all these, sadly. It says I already have L. Oh, is L in a different folder? That must be. That must be. I do need this, but there's got to be another way to get it, because I think I can only buy one. I, I will need another one. I need two. Double click. So we can do that one. I need. Oh, I have enough for yo yo. Okay, we can do that one. I can do the yo yo one. That's good. I don't know if the end code is actually going to help me. B codes, F codes, A codes, H codes. Interesting. Fire hits. Sadly, I can't just buy the E. Yes, we're buying that. We're just buying H, I don't care. And actually, okay. So three T. This one is you either just fight. Oh, okay. You have to fight the normal variant to get this one. Or you, and then we have to get S by fighting the EX variant. Eh, I'll save that. Nose, Lance, Wave Pit, Mud Wave, Circle Gun, H, H. How do we get Time Bomb? How do we get Time Bomb 3H? Because I could buy it. Just a rank. You know what? It create it completes the program advance. I'll buy it. Sense for shield. I do have get in three A. That's good. I need that. Now I need to figure out uh bug bomb. Which one do I have? Where's Bug Bomb? Oh, that's not a Mega Chip. Duh. Okay, hold on. Let me look for Bug Bomb very quick. I want to know which one I have. Cannon, White Shots, Electrical Cactus Ball, Double Soul, Element Rage, Bug Bomb, Reset Bomb. Wait, Bug Bomb. I need Bug Bomb A. I'll worry about it later. I need that one. Okay. So first, you know what? Let's get some program advances done. We can fill out the list. It definitely helps fill out the list if I do that. Uh, so need Vulcan's done. I need to get one more of these for later. We don't have 
enough for wide shots. I need to figure out where the other pencil one I can get is at. Except on quakes. Okay, wait a minute. Katana one. S. Have two of those. And let's also take care of the yo yo. Katana, we need to swap out. Nah, let's just get rid of that for a second. And we need Mark Man as well. But yeah, are people actually quitting Strike Force? And why are they actually quitting? Also, will it even last? Got one yo yo. That's, that's about it. We okay, we got Lark Man. We got Cortana. If I do this, I get rid of three chips. Yo-yos. If I do this, I can get two chips. I can only really get rid of two chips. Okay. Alright. Yeah, let's just do this. Program advance. Wild bird. I don't know how this works. Okay, I see how it works. I guess it can't hit anything in the back unless you area grab. Yeah, you, you have to area grab to hit something in the back. But it probably hits the enemy multiple times. I just don't know how many. Maybe it's three times. I just don't know if it's worth it. Now I gotta get the yo yo. One more chip. Yeah, I think Wild Bird is really only useful. Okay, so D, E, and F. Program advance. Great yo. Probably great yo yo with text limitations. Can hit three times, so 300 damage? Uh, maybe more than 300 damage, but even so. Kind of a weak one. I think he hit three tiles. Alright. Let's see, what's next? Anything else? Okay, slowly. Uncle Whirl, Uncle Spin. I still need another fire hit. Let's go. Oh, right. Get time bomb going. H, H, and H. Okay, that's fine. Oh, and I want to put. I'm putting Muramas back in. It looks like that's about all I can do. Because I can't use Poison Pharaoh. No, so yeah, we'll put. Alright, let's get another two program advances done.
set up on both sides. Let's... I can only get rid of like one thing. Fine, we'll get rid of the healing. This is why I need a better folder. Okay. Dark number man to get an extra turn of... Get rid of three chips this way. Okay. A G H I. Program advance. Shake parade one. So, 240 damage, because there's three of them, and they typically only hit one of them, hit a single enemy as once. I don't know, not really a fan. Well, then again, that's the level one variant. Uh, I had another skull. Now we need time bomb. Okay. First, number man. Let's get rid of this. One more program advance, and then we'll go for uh, what was it? The spin shake. Uh, for the second uh, electric shake shaker enemy. That's right. Um, I can get rid of a lot of ships. Get rid of one of them. I don't care. It's one less enemy on the field. I don't need to move. Still only two time bombs. I can go Toad Man. Or Dark Toad Man, and we'll get rid of three other chips. Hey, Act, how's it going? What's been going on? Right. Oh, yeah. Time bomb one, two, and three. Program advance. Time bomb plus. 600 damage. There we go. Okay, we got that figured out. I'm... Cactus yeah, you know what? I'll put Cactus Dance through that again. It's kind of useful for boss fights. Especially if you get him hit with the first one. L and and there we go. That's all done. Let's make a save. Still playing Mega Man's? Yeah, still playing Mega Man's. We're kind of close to the end, but there's like a bunch of roadblocks. Uh... Right now, like, we made it to, like, the final nebula area, like, the final secret area. But to do that, we need to S rank our six teammates. Colonel, Shadow Man, Number Man, Tomahawk Man, Night Man, and Toad Man. We need to do that. Oh, you tried Pokemon World? It's so laggy. Really? I never really had too much of an issue with that. Actually, I don't really have much of an issue with that. Huh, that's weird. 
But yeah, we need to S rank the six our six teammates to be able to move, uh, continue working on Nebula Area Six. However, there's doors we can open in Nebula Area Four, which Nebula Area Four, like one of the doors is get all of the make get all the mega chips. But to get all the mega chips, you also need to get all the uh, program advances done. So it's like kind of pick and choose what I want to do right now. I'm kind of working on program advances at the moment, or at least some of them. Let's see what I can get done. Right now, I am going for. Experience, and I also need to fight. No, we're just gonna fight the EX variant, and I believe the EX variant is in Nebula. Let me take a look. Just to double check. Five. EX. Undernet two. Okay, we could just hang out in Undernet two. Yeah, uh, I don't know why Pokey Rogue was laggy for you. Granted, it's not perfect. Like, I've had a few problems here and there, but usually when you get a run going, sometimes you don't, I just don't really deal with lag too much. Sometimes I do, and then some, very rarely do I have to refresh the page, but yeah. I don't really have too much trouble. barely hear me? Oh, come on. Is there something wrong with my settings? Hello. Hello. You know what? I think I know why. Why does it look so laggy? Turn up the volume. Can you hear me? I have the volume at max. How is it? I have the microphone volume at max. <sighs> Last week, my f my PC decided to update itself, and it messed with a bunch of settings. It must have affected my microphone, too. Well, first, it affected my microphone in the fact that it wasn't turned on. And I didn't know it. But now, it must have affected, like, the... How loud everything was because I kept the settings for a long time as it was and with no issues but then your PC updates and it's like nah it's not good now not good anymore not good enough don't you just I I, I really don't like PCs because of the stupid <laughs> without the oh God. I don't like PCs because they do the shit all the time Oh yeah, uh, <laughs> I guess just, okay, we're fighting Colonel. Not part of the plan, but we're fighting Colonel. Um, let's see, what's the best idea? Go Tomahawk. We'll have, we'll have my safety net. I mean, I was, I need to fight you, but I wanted to do that later, Colonel. Oh, there we go. Come on, hit him. There we go. All right. And now, uh, let's see. I wasn't planning for this. Um... I guess I guess we'll go Django. I think I can hit him now. The power of the sun ignores invincibility frames. It's only okay. Uh, 
Yeah, okay, I got hit. I'm gonna get rid of these two. But yeah, what I was saying before is that I don't deal with too much lag when I play Poke Rogue, but it does pop up here and there. But, you know, sometimes you'll I'll get on a run and, like, it'll work perfectly fine with no issues. But, again, there are some times where it will just, like, save or load something and just won't do it. So then, like, you have to reset. It's not perfect, but... I like to say I don't deal with too much lag. But were you able to get a run going, though? Okay, I can't... No, I, I can use normal number, man. Can't use these. Okay. Guess we'll do this. And watch as I die. There it is. Just wanted to see what it's about. Hmm. Yeah, uh, when I first played it, you know, a couple days ago. Actually, like, it was, like, sometime last week when I started, when I tried it out. Uh, the first few attempts, like, I could barely get a good run going. Because, like, I don't know, you, you don't really have much to work with. You don't have much to start using. But then, as soon as I got a few decent Pokemon, I was able to get a good run. Like, the farthest I gotten was a hundred, round 195. And that was the farthest I gotten. Oh, right, I do need to fight that enemy. I think we can get a lot of them from mystery data. Like, for example, um, I got myself randomly, I caught a Spearow. And it had its hidden ability. Its hidden ability is Sniper, which means if it gets a critical hit, it does even more damage than normal. I think normally a crit is. Uh, times 1.5 and I think with sniper it's times 2 ignore defense sort of thing so with that like once I got that I started using Spearow and Spearow just starts once I get far enough to where it evolves it gets a couple good moves it's starting to like get some kills and what really helps is that it gets focus energy and that boosts its crit rate so you can see what the Spearow was doing. Uh, oh, I should have Collect on. I need to have. I need to get Collect. Yeah, I, I need to swap my stuff. But yeah, the Spearow was just uh, getting a lot of kills with crits, and then once I had a. Basically a move relearner thing. I was able to get Drill Run on him. And that's a ground type move that has a higher chance to crit. <laughs> so once Spearow got going, Spearow was just unstoppable, more or less. But then not only that, I don't know if you got a good look, but each Pokemon can build up candy. You can use that candy to do two things. You could get a passive ability, or you could lower the cost of that Pokemon. To make it to where you could start with more Pokemon if you wanted to. Spearow's passive ability is Moxie. And Moxie increases your attack stat every time you get a KO. So, yeah. <laughs> Spiro, like, once Spiro got going, Spiro's going to town. 
was causing all so sorts of damage. It is insane. Okay. Let's see, what do I get? That was the new one. That was one of them. Spin. Okay. That was... Right. Okay. Now, that was the EX variant. If I lock enemy... I need to get a rank 9 or better for the B code. Yeah, that is the EX variant. Good. Um... I guess we'll Shadow Man. Actually, maybe I could time it. Maybe I could time it. Did that time it right? Oh, no. Just... A frame off. That would have hit both of them at the same time. Nope. That ain't it. I'm gonna use lock enemy right now. Don't play Pokemon. Uh, I mean, I was at I was doing the community day yesterday, but honestly, I haven't really been playing much other than that. Just picked it up. He's addicted now. Oh no. Oh no. But no, like after a while, I just kind of stopped in getting interested in it. I mean, I did community day yesterday, but wasn't fully my decision. <laughs> oh, after a while, I just got didn't get interested in it. I don't know why. Maybe I just got burned out after a while. Do you still play? Feel like they reduce the number of items you get from gifts. Oh, you know what? I think that might be true. Because I think I noticed that too. Like, that sounds right. That sounds like something I've noticed. I also don't like the updated character models, they don't look good. Not a fan. I might need this. Hold on. Let me take a look. Oh, come on. Get out of here. Is that the right code? No. I'm not going to keep that. They laid off the staff that worked on the character models? Really? I didn't hear that. I did not hear about that. I'm assuming when you say they laid uh, laid off the staff, you're talking about the ones who made the new character models, right? Or do you mean the ones that made the old ones, and that's why we got the new ones? Okay, they laid off the ones for the new ones, okay. Uh yeah, they don't look good. They really don't. Not a fan of how they look. Yeah, that's not the right code. My hope is they change them back to the old models. But I feel like 
if they were if they went far enough to fire uh to fire them i'm don't know why they haven't just reset the old models back but it might be because they added a whole bunch of different uh like body types like you could be very fat if you wanted to and they don't have models for those and i think that might be part of it that might be part of the reason why they didn't just brought the old models back that's just my guess but no like after like I haven't really been playing, like, any mobile games. Oh, it's Larkman. I, I mean, I don't need to fight you, so I'm gonna ignore you. <laughs> I already shot your S, uh, SP chip. I'm good. Uh, but yeah, I, I haven't really been playing, like, any mobile games. Like, after Dissidia shut down, I, like, really haven't gone back to any of the other ones I have. Like, Fey or Pokemon Masters. Like, I tried, but I still couldn't get into them. And I haven't jumped into anything new. Which, honestly, is probably a good thing. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was looking into uh, getting uh, Paper Mario pre-ordered. Because that comes out this week. Only to find out that Amazon has uh, it sold out. <laughs> so, it's probably going to be a bit. But I got to check every day. Pick up a copy. Get one ordered. Yeah, I did hit them both. Double delete. That actually might work. Rank 10. No, not the right one. I needed it to be a rank 9 or higher, so that's true. But I need... I need the B code. Maybe if I S rank them, but I need a better starting setup. Guardian back in. That probably help. Yeah, all I need is a Guardian and then plus 10. Yeah, I should put the Guardian back in. What did I swap for it? Yeah, that ain't it. Yeah, Guardian would help. I took it out because the level 3 variance, especially in Nebula area, wasn't really that. It, it just felt like it wasn't really doing much. But now that we're on the weaker variance right now. Where is it? There you are. Uh, yeah, we'll get rid of Django. Django's just kind of okay. And I don't think there's a way to power up at Django SP. But yeah, I haven't really booted up, like, any mobile games. I just haven't found anything that I really could get hooked into again. You know what's probably for the best? <laughs> I could get distracted by other things. Like Battle Network. Or Poke Road. Which, I'm gonna be honest, like... Ugh, like... Sometimes I'll get on a run where I'm like, okay, I'm gonna play one run of Poke Rogue and then I'm gonna try to be productive. And then it's like the rest of the night has happened before the run ends. Like, oh, dang it, I just wasted my night. At least when I play, like, Samurai Warriors on my own, I'm like, okay, I can play him around a mission or two, That and then that's an easy stopping point. But with Poke Rogue, you know, it's just like, but I could keep going. 
just like, I, I could stop now, but I could easily just get go keep going, see how far I can go. But yeah, I'm hoping to get Paper Mario Thousand Year Door picked up soon, but it, right now it really depends on if Amazon, you know, restocks. Which, honestly, it's not the worst sign, because if they're out of stock, that probably means it's gonna sell very well, and that's what I really hope for. A Thousand Year Door. I will stream Thousand Year Door. Uh, it comes out this weekend, uh, like, this... Thursday or Friday. It's just a matter of when I could get it ordered and get it over here. But I will stream it. That will I will stream it after Bound once I'm done with Battle Network 5. And when I get a hands on the copy. But that is the plan for the next set. Of course I finally get an S rank and I get the wrong chip. Of course, thanks game. Thanks. But I will stream it. That's part of the plan. Because I love Thousand Year Door. It's a great game. Even if they censored it a little bit. At least, I, I hope, like, that it's not going to hinder. It probably won't, but still. I'm annoyed that they're, they censored that scene to begin with. It's like, why? Kids were, f like, no one was offended back in 2004. And now people are offended about it now. Like, really? And it's such a minor thing, too. Alright, another shot. S rank. There it is. There's the B code. Alright. With that done, I'm gonna buy another lock enemy and... Wait, can I buy... No, I can't buy another lock enemy. But I'm gonna use the program advance and then I gotta look up what I might need to do next for program advances. And uh, when I stream Thousand Year Door... Kind of like when I played the original Paper Mario, I plan to, I think, go with a badge-only run. And with Thousand Year Door, you can just straight up do badge-only. It will probably be difficult, but, you know, what? why not? Something different. Last time I played Thousand Year Door a few years ago my, on my own time, uh... I didn't do badge only, I did something like a badge priority sort of thing. Where it's like, I mainly focused on badges, but if I felt like I needed like more FP, more HP, I went with that for a level, but I tried to go with badges only. But this one I'm gonna try to do just straight up only badges, nothing else, no other upgrades. But yeah, when I get my hands on a copy and we finish Battle Network 5, I'm going to go with Thousand Year Door. Oh, come on. Uh, there's one. Have you ever played Thousand Year Door Act? Have you ever played it before? I really only get like one or two, ch get rid of one or two chips anyway, so. I'll do that. Chaos Lord. Um. 
Dark Toad Man. Let's get rid of these. And I can go Colonel just to get rid of a chip. Get rid of long brit long blades. Alright. Let's get rid of Muramasa anti navi. Not that I can use Muramasa anyway. I'm not evil. Alright. B, C, and D. Program Advance Shake Parade 2. to stance back in. Alright. With that done, where are we at? So... We sh shake Parade. Three, but we could do that once I open the door back up. We'll take care of all the level 2 and level 1s that I can. Boxer, Cactus Stance. The white shots, we could get them all on the level 3 variant because it's just blue mystery data. Gunsoul 3D, apparently we get it in green mystery data in the undernet. So I'm going to have to grind for that. And I need two of them. White shots, uh, yeah, ship comp one, green mystery data. It looks like end level two, end area two, level three, green mystery data, and then it was the EX variant. Yeah, that's right. Okay. So we could take care of all the white shots on the level three when I open the, do the darkness door back up. Um, just kind of double checking. Spread, Shake Parade, Cactus Dance, Hyper Burst, Life Sword, Yo Yo, Pit Hockey. Great Yo Yo, Pit Hockey. We can't do Poison Pharaoh. I gotta look up Bug Bomb. Actually, yeah, where do I get Bug Bomb? Oh, more can too. I need one. Uh. Rank 7 through 10. Okay, I could probably do that. I need an F code for Mark Cannon 2. You could probably do that in, in Area 2 ACDC. Yeah, well, let me find Bug Bomb. I don't really want to be in Area 1. That's where Nightman is. I don't want to deal with them. Alright. Gotta find the cannon enemies. Come on, where are you? Okay. Bug bomb, bug bomb. Mini bomb, an energy bomb, mega energy crack with pair bomb. There's bug bomb, okay. Undernet 1, level 3 green mystery data. So I could get that later. But level 3 green mystery data in area 1. What's the fastest route to area? Yeah, I think it's just going through the middle. Okay. Working my way backwards. Alright, I need a kill from the cannon raid. The best route would actually be this. I don't think I need to lock enemy. There's like no enemies in ACDC. Yeah, that's going to be an issue. Uh, we need more cannon F again. That's what I'm working on. Um, okay. Uh, you played... You played Thousand Year Door on the GameCube? <laughs> yeah, I, I know what type of GameCube you're talking about. 
the, the infamous Nintendo PC variant. I bet there's a lot you could do on the Nintendo PC variant. No, oh, you did play on the GameCube. Okay. Now what's with that question mark act? If it first came out on GameCube or the Switch. No, it's a it was on the GameCube first. It came out in 2004. You want to feel old? Thousand Year Door is 20 years old this year. I feel old. Thanks, Thousand Year Door, for making me feel old. If you were playing RE4, that one's going to be 20 years old next year. Of course it's... Of course, it's guard and not the cannon that I need. Okay, what can I do about this? I could get a double delete if they line up correctly. They have to line up correctly. If, at this point, it's already taken too long. Yeah. Took way too long. But yeah, at some point I was thinking of re- uh, streaming it, but then they announced it. I'm like, well, I know exactly what I'm playing because I did not think they would ever actually remake Thousand Year Door. That was not something I would have thought would ever happen. Um... Okay, I'm gonna try to go for a double delete. And the best route would be this way. Okay, that's not a double key. Never mind. We got the code anyway. That's all I needed. Okay, if I do this, we're going to get another program advance going. Alright. Mark Cannon 2. I'll just... I didn't mean to take that out. Alright. With that, we also need Gridman. Where are ya? Gridman SP. And I guess we'll swap out Muramasa. But yeah, with Thousand Year Door... Every, you know, every time I replay it, there are moments that I do kind of dread. There's a lot of backtracking in Thousand Year Door. Which is, it's one of those things where it's like, I love Thousand Year Door. And I also love the original Paper Mario. But like, I feel like there's way more backtracking in Thousand Year Door than there is in the original Paper Mario. And if they have a similar amount of backtracking, uh... It just feels like there's even more backtracking in Thousand Year Door, or it's even more, like, worse. It handles, handles it a lot worse. I don't know. But I still love Thousand Year Door. There's a, I just like Rogueport, honestly. Like, it is such a shitty place. <laughs> okay, we got one of them. Let's get Dark Number Man. Let's get rid of these two. But it's like, because Rogueport is such a shitty place, it, it has the most personality. Uh, we got one of them here. OK. 
can't really get rid of too much, can I? Guess not. Let's get rid of Cactuball, I guess. That kind of sucked. Um, can I go? Yeah, I could go Toad Man, and then I can get rid of the recovery. Let's get rid of fire hit. Just the fact that the center of t of the town of Rogueport, there's just a noose hanging there. It just kind of says a lot of things, doesn't it? It already, like, tells you a lot about its town. <laughs> its history. That there's just a noose in the center of town. Number man, there we go. We can finally do something with this. And then freaking Mario gets mugged at the beginning of the game. Alright, here. Uh, there we go. Mark Cannon 2, F, F, and then Gridman SP. And we might as well just throw in these berries. Program Advance, football. Okay, I have no idea how this works. hundred and eighty damage for what looks like a single hit but it hits four enemies I don't know like it doesn't feel that great I'm gonna throw in my swords back in and let's get grid man out of here With that, what do we got? Okay. And now I think we can actually swap it back to the level 3 variants. Because I think we got everything. Everything else can be done. I'm going to just do another double check. Yeah, Giga Cannon 2 and 3, Vulcan 2 and 3. We just buy them or find them in Green Mystery Data. Actually, wait a minute. If I need to find them in Green Mystery Data, let me double check. Net Dealer. Uh, Orn Area 3, Item Panel. Scilab Area Level 1. Oh, no. Okay. Let's work on high cannon. What do I have? D, E, and I need F. Drill comp three mystery, green mystery data. It looks like it's not affected by it, by, uh, by the nebula door. I have F, so I need end, er, er, end area one net dealer. And it looks like gargoyle comp two green mystery data. Although it says the Japanese version. That I'm pretty sure it has to be in the English version, because if not, it's not listing a different one. But it's, uh, these, uh, two of these are net dealer, green mystery data, gar gargoyle two, okay. Okay, two, we need B. Level one green mystery data, okay, I need to change it to level one. Okay, three. We can buy one at the net dealer and area four level one green mystery data. Okay. Let's go and change it to level one. I'm gonna need money too so I can buy what I'm missing. Probably gonna have to do a kind of like when I did bug frags earlier. I need to do a Zenny run. I 
don't know if we'll get every program advance ready to go today. But we're gonna try. Some trap. Because I'll probably run into a couple of green mystery data. Or not. Never mind. Wasn't worth it. Oh well. What a waste of a hundred zenny. <laughs> Close the door. Go. So now we need to go to Oron Area 3. It's level 1 green mystery data. The fastest route to, is to actually go to the island. Then we also need to go to End Area 4 for our level 1 green mystery data. Is that right? Or is that the one I already have? I know I I have a sh I have a goldfish memory sometimes. Yeah. Okay. No. And area four. All right. Let's start with going to Oron. Word to Area 3. There's also a chance we'll find Shadow Man. Also, I don't... I don't need Collect anymore. Don't need it. Sadly, Reflect is just not that great anymore. There's that. Um, charge goes here, speed goes here, there we go. But yeah, it's a good, it's, in some ways it's a good sign that it's sold out on Amazon. That means people are wanting it. Let's just see if it does, how, how much it sells in comparison to Origami King. Honestly, that's going to be a big metric for me. I want to know. I really want to know if uh, it's going to tie or beat Origami King. Or, hell, if Thousand Year Door even doesn't sell as well as Origami King. Even though I don't want that. <laughs> I really don't want that. That's the bad future. Because I think how Thousand Year Door sells is going to affect how Paper Mario is going to be made going forward. And look at Shadow Man. I did not... I mean, I need to fight you, but I didn't really want to fight you. Um, how do I... You know what? Even though I already know Toad Man's not the best starting one for you, but because of your clones, but that's... I already have two set up for Cactus Dance. I might as well try to get all three. Okay, I can have my safety net. I can also have Leader Raid. Let's have both. Leader Raid. Safety net. Makes me almost want to put another anti-damage in. Uh, I'm not really liking... Actually, you know what? Let's get more damage out of this. Or not. Okay. Wow, nothing. Okay, it's fine. It'll be that way. Okay, get you confused. Hmm. Hey, look, there, w there was a uh, bodyguard. Yeah, this is not a good run. All right, what do we got? L, M, and N. 
Program Advance Cactus Dance 3. I'll just wait for him to attack me. Well, that was a waste of Cactus Dance. Uh, Dark Toad Man it is. And we have Long Blades. Okay, Shadow Man, do your thing. Of course you're in the back. Can't hit you when you're in the back. There we go. Done. It's not an S rank. That is nowhere near close to being one. There's a chance we'll fight Shade Man, too, while we're here. I still need his Dark Chip. Although, I think there's another way to get the Dark Chips of the four uh, Nebula Agents. Come on, Vulcan. Zenny. Alright. Time to leave and go back in. Untrap. Let's try it again. Orin Area 3, go! Yeah, just working on program advances right now. I think we'll try to get what we can today. And then maybe tomorrow we'll try for S ranking. Whether I have the program advances or not. I don't know. We just kind of have like a few th different things to work on. And it's just kind of up to us what we want to do. I feel, honestly, I feel like Shadow Man's gonna be probably the hardest one to go for, for me. Let's see here? Nope, not there. I don't even know if I need to use Untrap. Oh, yep, I do. Vulcan 2B, sweet. Alright, that takes care of that. The other one we need to buy... No, wait, I already have it. Two A, B, and C. Okay, yeah, I have it all. At least on that end. Now, for this one, we need to go to end area four and get the level one mystery data. We also need to go to end area one for the net dealer. We could also get a green mystery data in the second factory comp. Hmm. How much money do I have? Not enough for the net dealer, not yet. So let's restock on on traps. I know, no, I can buy them here, and then we'll go for trying to get the ones in end area four. Do that first. And then if I get the Zenny, we'll go to end area one. Wait, what's the fastest route? No, the fastest route to end area four is actually to use our PC. End area four, level one green mystery game. This is the fastest route. And area three. And we'll use untrap. All right. This is the closest way to end area four. there. 
I don't need to fight anything. We're all good here. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, if I'm wanting to go Navi hunting, swapping it to the level 1 variants isn't the worst idea. Only because I can run away from the viruses very easily. Granted, I haven't been having that much trouble running away. Even on the level 3 variants, but still, that is an option I can do. Oh, yeah. I actually don't know too much about the Thousand Year Door remake. I've been trying my best to avoid a lot of information as possible. Basically, all I know is I saw the opening trailer, the original reveal trailer, and I only know about like one bit of censorship at near the beginning of the game, but that's all I know. And I thought, like, I was really upset about the censorship because it's just like, I don't like it. What's the point of doing it? We were fine with it in 2004. <laughs> but like, I thought about it. What do, what, what matters to me more? Me wanting to get Paper Mario back, back on track or not supporting the censorship? And then I thought about it. I'm like, well, freaking uh, Super Mario RPG has, at, you know, a little bit of censorship, but yeah, I still have that. So I guess it's not strong enough or not a big enough piece of censorship for me to care as much, clearly. But I'm still annoyed by it. I think I realize where I need to go for the green. Yeah, I realize where I need to go. And I think for Thousand Year Door, as much as I'm annoyed by, by it, I'd rather get Paper Mario back on track. If, if, if the perch, if, if Thousand Year Doors sells well, and they take that as a sign of, hey, people like this type of Paper Mario, we'll make more like this, and that's a win in my book. Paper Mario fans are like, we won, we're getting Thousand Year Door, and be like, no, you haven't won anything yet. Stop saying you won, you haven't won anything. Where's the other green mystery data? <laughs> it has to sell well. That's... It has to sell well. And ideally, tie... You either want it to tie, or it needs to sell significantly more than Origami King. That's how you know you probably won. And even then, it might not do anything, but still, like, that's the... Because I don't like the change that Sticker Star made. Many people don't. I haven't played that, uh, Color Splash or Origami King. I hear they are better versions of that formula. That's fine. But not what I wanted Paper Mario to be. Paper Mario was like with the first two games and they haven't stuck with them since. But they had a formula, damn it. And <laughs> I want it back there. At some point, I'll probably give Color Splash and Origami King a try, but I'm just still kind of salty. I know there's another green mystery data here somewhere. Uh, actually... Another anti-damage. Again, I might throw them in. And that's nothing. Oh, there's a little pathway there. Okay. That might be where one of the green mystery data is at. Alright. 
up here. There it is. Okay. I didn't know it could be here. And you know, this entire time we had the chance of fighting uh, Number Man. Zenny. Totally worth it. I assure you. But yeah, if there's going to be more changes to Thousand Year Door, maybe extra bosses, maybe a bigger post-game, I don't know anything about it. And I kind of want to try to keep that as... I'm trying to keep it like that. I really don't want to know anything beforehand. Because I'm going to buy it anyway. Mystery data. Nope, not over there. I, I could throw sneak run in. I could throw sneak run in. Bug fragment. Yeah, I'm gonna throw sneak run. Just to make this go a little bit faster. If I run into Number Man, I run into Number Man. Okay, let's check here first before I forget. Okay, not there. Go back this way. Up here. Keep forgetting to the left was the nebula code, so there's not going to be a green mystery data over there. Not that way. It's just going to loop around. Nothing down there. There might have been an untrap there, so... Not an untrap, an unlocker. So I don't think I can bother check there anyway. Vulcan 3M, there it is. That's done. Let me put this back. Because I don't think I'll need Sneak Run anymore. Alright. So Vulcan 3L, I can buy in the End Area 1 Net Dealer. So I could do that at any time. Let's get Vulcan 2 ready to go in in the per, in the library let's get this done all right so we'll get Vulcan 3 done later then I need to look up the cannons Right, Drill Comp 3, we could do that at any time. And then there was a Area 1 Net Dealer, that's right. And then Gargoyle Comp. Could be done at any time. Alright. Yeah, cannons, we can wait. Maybe wait a second. Get you out of here, there's that. What do we got? Got two of them. Let's keep this going. Yeah, get rid of that. Okay. Let's. Might as well use Colonel, I guess. Get rid of Chaos Lord. I guess we'll get 
rid of. Oh yeah, by the way, you could change your shot to Vulcan, your charge shot with Colonel. That could be useful if you're going for a certain build. I don't know. Could be fun to use. I guess I'm going with Dark Toad Man, Aqua Whirl. Get rid of that shit. Need one more Vulcan. Dark Number Man, and I guess we'll get rid of Shadow Man. Not that I'm gonna use it. But... All right, A, B, and C. Program Advance Infinite Vulcan 2. There's that. It just kept going for a little bit. Right, let me throw Cactus Dance back in. Alright. That's safe. What am I doing? Uh, lever. Alright. Saving those for later. Boxer 3 we can take care of later. Shake Parade 3 we take care of later. All the wide shots can be done on level 3 because some of the, two of them are green mystery data. Shake Parade 3. Cactus Dance 1, 2, 3. H Burst. Life Sword. Great Yo Yo. Pit Hockey. Cosmo Prison. Poison Pharaoh, we get done on level 3. Wild Bird. Football. Big Noise. Time Bomb. Bodyguard. And we can't do Pile Driver. And if I'm correct, we need... Green Mystery Data. Under... No, Undernet Battle Mystery Data. Which we could do that at any time. So yeah, okay. Everything else can be done on the level 3 variant. Alright. Let's go open the nebula door back up. And I think I need, I need to open both of them, so that's going to take a little bit. After opening them back up, I don't think there'll be really any reason to close the door, unless I want to make it easier for me to find the navvies. But it's easy to close the door just all together for the level 1. It takes some time to get the level 2 variant, though. have the money for another lock enemy yet. I'm thinking though if we do get the money what I might do is buy a lock enemy we'll go back to nebula area and we'll find a green mystery data fight that uh, uh, kind of like bug frags and we'll go for zenny this time or bug fragments, but I kind of need Zenny. Yeah, like this. Except, uh, uh, you know, I need to be able to take out the one in the back more efficiently. Fast cage. Alright, there's that. We go. That's enough. There we go. Don't care. Full cast. Are you kidding? I don't need full cast. Wait, that 
Was that the level 3 variant? I don't even know anymore. Sword B. No, these are level 2 variants. Yeah, I still need to open the other door. I gotta make a trip through Nebula. This is a fight that I was actually looking for too. However, it's gonna be harder, but you could totally make it work. This is probably not a fight I would lock enemy though. This is not one I would. Um, let's try it though. Right now I need to really focus on getting rid of the shield guy. That was really important. Now... Do this. And... I'm gonna get hit. And that is how the strategy is. That is... That is totally intentional. That is definitely part of the strategy. Clearly. Watch me get hit. Alright, I can make this work. Could have been a lot worse. I don't need the Fist of Justice! I don't need Duo's Fist. If I want that green mystery data, I have to go this way, I think. Okay. Let's see if I can make this work. There's this. Mass gauge. Might as well set up anti-damage. Get over. Want get? Oh no, that's right. The shield's blocking him. Uh, I forgot that the shield's actually blocking him right now. Uh, there's a way I can make this work. Never mind. I failed. It would have worked if I did it right. That's more Zenny, perfect. This is actually the fight I would have wanted to lock enemy. I just don't have a good starting one. Totally do this. There's that. Okay, what do we got? Another one. Alright. I'll take it. Okay, that could have gone worse, but yeah, I made it work. Bug fragments and more of those. No, not this fight. Oh no, I can't run. 
Whatever shall I do about this? Can I run? Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you, Mega Man, for running. Nebula Area 3. Almost there. Can I? Can I do this? Can I make this work? I can. It's going to be a little bit tricky, though. Should I just mash the button first. Oh, well. I thought I got Invis up, but okay. There we, go. we got rid of him. Keep that guy attacking. Use that. And then, here we go. Scully! Done. Justice. Fist of Justice. This is why you need to, like, save when you're doing bug frag grinding, which I'm not yet, but, you know. How many times I've gotten the Fist of Justice? Or, uh, Full Cust. Yeah, that's not a... That's not a bad fight. I would still rather go with the Scully or the... Actually, the one in Area 1 might be the best one. Alright. Open the door to Merkland. What do we got? I have the Zenny. There is no... There's nothing I can do. Alright. With that... Let's buy one lock enemy. And I think I'll just restock on... On traps. See what I can do. Do I want a Zenny grind now? That's not what I meant. Hold on. Walk into me. Oh, it's 500 Zenny per. I thought it was 100. Oh, well. Either way. Okay. Do I want a Zenny grind now? I mean, I will need a lot. Nah, you know what? Let's start with... Let's do some grinding. We're... On traps, basically. Okay. We need... F code for high cannon, and it's Drill Comp 3 Green Mystery Data. All the way back to the drill. Let's go to the drill. This is... I am uh, annoyed that Battle Network 5 forces you to go back to the drill comp so many times. Granted, I've double-checked there many times, so some of it, a lot of it's on me. However, with the amount of time... They, they force you to go there, like, what, two or three extra times? It's a little ridiculous. And then... You throw in, like, the hide-and-seek kid, like, another two times. Makes me hate going through here. Okay. Drill Comp 3. I don't know if we need Untrap. I don't know if you can find viruses in... Green Mr. Data in these areas. So let's not use Untrap right now. Let's see, what do you got? Zenny, we'll take it. Uh, nothing. 
nothing there. Nothing there. Actually, wait a minute. Will sneak run work well here? I know it's level 3 variants, but these are the weaker enemies. I don't know. We'll see. There's no Navi here. Oh, could work. Nope. Not there. I need to figure out where all the green mystery tails are. I don't have them memorized. What about... There we go. Zenny. I think there are only two per area. Oh! Can you not go through... Go to the vision burst again? Interesting. I thought you could. Yeah, I think there are only two. That's usually the case. Yep. Got a little extra zenny, but not what I'm looking for. Okay, green mystery data. I can and F. That is exactly what I was looking for. Alright, with that, we got that ready to go. Now... I will actually activate that later. We need G, which is end area one, level two green mystery data, or end area one net dealer, and that's the route I'm gonna go. And H is supposedly green mystery data in Gargoyle Comp 2. However, this is specifying the Japanese version, but it's giving no other, nothing else to indicate on where it could be. So, it, I think it still is the case. I think it's just, that's still the case. Because I can't think of where else you're supposed to get it. It's not listening to anything else. How much money do I Yeah, I don't have that much money. Time to leave. I guess we'll head to Gargoyle Calm. Hopefully we can get this done. And again, I'm not going to use Untrap. I don't think I'll need it. I think that really only applies to the actual internet areas, but... I could just be misremembering. What do you say? Oh, okay. You gave a uh, lotto code? Yeah. Is there anything else in here? No. Yeah, he gave you something. Was it one of the dark ships? He either way, he gave you something that was actually needed. Okay, gargoyle it is. All right, we need to get to area two. No, that's always the dead end. I keep forgetting. way. I might as well grab it since I'm here. This way. Up and left. There we go. Up here. Keep going. Okay. Area 2. It's 
find the two greens here. Oh, Sneak Run is totally helping me right now. I just realized that. Anything over here? No, not really. Okay, head up here. Nope. I think that just loops back. Up here? No green. Okay, there's one. Let's go grab this. Green mystery data. I seed Q. That. Well, I have to take this route. That's a dead end. Another dead end. Where's the other green? What's over here? I missed this. Okay. Mega Energy Bomb C. Okay. I never got that green mis that blue mystery data. Okay. Man, I'm missing a few blue mystery data out and about in some of these dungeons. Here's the other green. Bug Fragment. Alright. Time to go back in. You know what? Um... I'm actually kind of concerned. I'm canon. Oh, no, two. No, I want five. That's not helpful. Way, grab that. Bug fragment. Up here to the left. Up. Keep going straight. Area two. Okay. Is there like a. No, that's not really that helpful. So far, I have no other leads on M Cannon. This is all I got at the moment. Down here. That moves back. I'm trying to see if they could be in any other spot. Probably would be. So far, same spot. M Cannon H, yeah, I do not understand why this site says, basically specifies the Japanese version. It's right here. The other one I'm going to have to buy. Okay. So we have High Cannon ready to go. M Cannon, we need to, we need to buy the G chip. Vulcan 3, we need to buy. Work on Boxer. That would be next. Which one am I missing? Boxer, Boxer, Boxer. Where? How are you? There we go. I have G. I need E. E, where, we can, where can we get that? EX variant. I'm reading Scilab 3. Uh, 5. We can go to the Furnace Comp. Ooh, that might actually be better. Squirrel Comp, Scilab 3 and 4. Net Battle Comp, End Area 4. Dumpling Comp. There's actually plenty of areas. Oh, I didn't mean to go back in. Uh, the dumpling comp is one of them. We, that might be better. 
close by. And what rank do I need? What rank do I need? Rank 9 or plus. But I have a chance of getting G. Okay. Okay, once we get to the dumpling comp, I'm gonna have to put collect back in. Do I have lock enemy? I do. Hope hopefully I won't need it. Hopefully there are not too many enemy types in the dumpling computer. There we go. Sneak run. Oh, we're going to collect, actually. This goes here, this goes here. Goes there. It's usually faster if I can equip everything. Alright. Let's go hunt some boxers. Fire boxers. Okay. Can I get a double delete? Not really. What is the best idea? Scullies? Sure. Alright, I forgot. He'll just punch randomly now. It's kind of funny. That's the G code. Not, not what I need. I need a rank 9 or higher from them. This works. Ooh, this really works. Dark Toad Man. Triple delete. Is it enough? Here's the E code. That's ready. Okay, next is the super spread stuff. We could get all of them done here in level three, but let's see. Ship comp one. I didn't need to do this. Ship Comp 1, Green Mystery Data. If you're playing the European version or the North American version. In this case, since we're checking Green Mystery Data, this would be better. Alright, let's go to the ship. If you're playing the Japanese version, apparently it's in Ship Comp 2, because clearly they had to rearrange it around, I guess. It was too broken to get in Area 2. That makes no sense. I don't know why. <laughs> uh, and for White Shot 2, if I'm correct, we need to go to End... Wait. Uh, we will need to go to End Area 2 for Green Mystery Data. So that's easy to get to.
Time to look for green mystery data. Uh, green mystery data. Well, let's see. Where are the spots I could be at? Not up there. That's the teleporter out. There's one. Zenny. Okay, we'll take it. going. Take the second path. Oh, I see the other one. Down. Nope, not that way. Wait, is it? Is it back on the first set? One second. Did I not try hard enough? Oh no, maybe it's in the third set. Hold on. There's a third one, right? Yeah. And we find... Thunder. Not what I need. We even come back in. see it from up top. Yeah, there it is. Green mystery data. Bug fragment. We'll take it. I think I'll just go straight for the... this one, because it looks like it's in the same spot. I thought that would have disappeared by now. Recover 80. Oh, don't need that. That's not what I'm looking for. Try again. Th attempt number three. Is that? Yep, still in the same spot. Green mystery data. 500 zenny. Kind of seems like they're just all in the same spots. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god, go away! There you go. Thunder L again. I'm reading Ship Cop 1. I could check ship comp too. This m this might be a case where it is based on the Japanese version, so it still might actually be in ship comp too. We'll check through ship comp too, because I'm not sure. Well, no, like I don't know. I guess we'll I guess we'll go through two as well. Because honestly, I'm not sure. I think it's actually faster to take the hit. I don't know. Both take just as long. Six hundred zenny. Yeah, let's take a look. Because honestly, these collections are a little bit weird. Because they're clearly using the Japanese version as a base, but then they're using, they're just plopping in a lot of the English stuff, which that's why some things are causing problems, like the whole glitch that was in Battle Number 6, where you could soft lock yourself. This might be a case where you need to actually this is using Japanese version green mystery data. Could be wrong, but might be the case. 
We're gonna find out. I saw the other one. Where is it? There it is. Well, we don't know yet. Still don't know. Gonna check both. see how this works so that's the thing like even though these might be using like the Japanese ROMs and then just plopping like the English translation and some of the details in from the English versions uh, it did change some of the things about Battle Network 6 so it's like some of the some of the data got thrown in there I guess I don't know I don't know what it is. We just gotta keep going. Just gotta keep on going. Wave pit. That's not what I need. That's me being impatient. One, Zenny. That's fine. All right, then we take the second path. get Zenny. I mean, like, I don't mind the Zenny, it's just I need a chip. And the internet, the internet never lies. Ship Comp 2 green mystery data, or Ship Comp 1 green mystery data. Just like with Gargoyle and Drill Comp, it was the same stuff. internet never lies, clearly. We should always trust the internet. Wait a bit. Okay. Let's see. I mean, if we get no luck here, I'm gonna probably just have to turn it back to level one. Turn it back to level one and fight the EX variants. Okay. There's one. Sword. Okay. Don't need that. Grab that. Yeah, I'll eat that. That's fine. That. That, that, one's there. I don't know what's the more annoying. The constant whirlpools and, like, currents slowing you down in this one? Or gar Gargoyle having way too many, like, uh... Oh, what was it? Like, way too many, like, twists and turns. The map's a little confusing. Luck Fragment. I think the internet might be lying to me. We'll go one more time. If I don't find it, I'm probably just going to have to swap it down to level 1. Because I'm not finding anything. Oh. Unless it's in here. No. Oh, we could just use the extra folder that I have. That, okay, you know what? We'll just use the extra folder that I have here. It already has it. I'm, uh, since I'm back in here, I might as well check one more time, but we'll just use extra folder. I don't remember who gave me that folder that has it, but you can just use it. Okay, no, 
not that way. We need... Come on, go away. Go away, jeez. Probably would have been faster just to eat the hit. Sunny. All right, we'll check area two one more time. I didn't mean to do that, oh well. And what do we get? Sword again. One more green mystery data, and then we'll move on. We'll look for the level 2 variant. And we get... Okay. I have no clue, like... Like, I have... I did not find it, clearly. And in either case, whether it's ship comp one or two, I'm told green mystery data, but maybe maybe they're both wrong. So luckily it was in the extra folder that I got. I don't remember which one I got to have it, but it's in there. So we'll just go that route. We do need wide shot two though. We need, we need G, which that is end area to level three green mystery data. That won't be too bad. Cause we could just go right here. Untrap. I don't think there are any navvies here. Because this is where Mega Man was, so I don't think there are any navvies. Slasher? Okay, that's one. Where's the other one? Not there. There it is. White blade, not what I need. Trap. It's always just a good idea. Right here, what did we get? Wide shot 2G. There we go. That is that is what I needed. Might as well grab the other one. The other green mystery data. Is any good. Actually, I need an unlocker on me, thinking about it. Right. My shot 2G is ready to go. Then wide shot 3. S, we need to fight the EX variant. To find the EX variant, let's see. Uh, pipe comp, factory comp one, soul server comp. Pipe might be the fastest route. Okay. Pipe comp, that was in, that was at the boat. I think everything, you know what, let's, let's get some of these program advances done. That way they're in the list. I like to just constantly, like, check off the list, you know? Let's equip that one. Okay, that, we're gonna need collect back in. At least we will. We will need it back in. Alright, what do we got? Oh, 
Hmm. Whatever. Yeah, get rid of the rock shifts this way. Oh no, I can't see. There we go. We'll be fine. Just start getting rid of chips. How far, how, how powerful can this get? 110, okay. And it's pretty decent range too, and it caps out pretty early. So that's not that bad. Almost there, come on. I couldn't edit this folder, so I can't add. Well, there's one. There's one of them. I can't put fast gauge in. Uh, not yet. Oh, okay, come on. Fun part about program advanced grinding. Can you use two before it ca uh, lowers? One. Oh! It actually uses up the, the gauge. That's interesting to mess around with. I can easily see you messing around with that in multiplayer. You think you're about to get some more chips? Custom gauge. Nah, you're not getting into that quick. There's two. Almost there. L, M, and N. Program Advance Super Spreader 1. Or Super Spread? I don't know. Shoots three of them. In level one's case, that's 300 damage. Alright. Put that back in. Let's get the high cannons done. Even though I think you could actually get high cannon done on... Yeah, you can get high cannon done with this one if you wanted to. I could have tried working on both of them with that case. Well, two of the high cannons are here. That's a good start. here. Let's see. Start weakening. Get rid of the... Get rid of this guy. There we go. Here's that. D. E. F. Program advance. Giga Cannon 2. Get out of here. Might as well have some fun with Chaos Lord. Get out of here. Alright. With that done, we don't have that. We still need Vulcan 3L, which requires money. And one shot two. E F and G. Not my 
favorite loadout. Not my favorite. Granted, it's because we're in level 3 right now. Well, there's two of them. Honestly, uh, Chaos Lord actually will get not kill the other one because Metar's helmets are indestructible, except against Guardian. Oh, never mind. Never mind. They don't. They don't stop Chaos Lord. Good. It, how it should be. As it should be. Okay, I'll, I'd rather have this one. Let's get rid of some stuff. There we go. Might as well set it up just in case I get hit, I guess. Now I can just sit back, relax, until we get all of, all of the super wave chips. White shots. There's one. Get rid of more chips this way. Alright, there's two of them. I still only have two. Okay, I gotta get rid of stuff. Let's get rid of... Wait, no, hold on. Toad Man used something up. Okay. Might as well get rid of my healing one. Chaos Lord. Okay. Let's go Colonel. Get rid of Shadow Man. Hmm. Alright. Throw this in the... Can you throw anything in the arm? Okay. Not that it matters, but we'll throw that in the arm change. Again, not that it matters. Just for fun. Look at this. Scully 3! That's a chart shot. Okay, here we go. E, F, and G. Program Advance Super Spread 2. 120 damage per hit. Boxer 3, that's right. We could do Boxer 3. Forgot we got that. That's another one on the list. Wait, here we go. Uh, e and F. There we go, that's another one on the list. Just getting rid of you now. Just 
get out of the way. Um... There, not enough. The normal number soul. Get rid of two of these. As well as the plus. Plus chips. Muramasa. Oh, okay. E, F, and G. Program Advance. Boxer 3. 200 damage per hit, but it's still kind of over the place. Now, with that... Okay. So we're checking for... Lark 3. Let me put my... Put my fire hits back in how I want them. I'd rather keep G, keep them all at the same code. Alright. Let's go back to the boat. We need a rank 9 or higher. And I, I think this is probably one of the better spots to find it, based on what I'm reading. Honestly, if you could find it in just a random computer, you're probably better off there because there are way, way less enemy variety. It, uh, it was the pipe? Pipe. Okay, this is radar, not what I'm looking for. Not what I'm looking for. Air conditioner? Or maybe the pipe comp is somewhere else. Hmm. Well, we're gonna find out. Screw? No, this ain't it. What's the final one? I'm reading, you can find the EX variant in Gargoyle 4. This is engine comp, this ain't it. Gargoyle 4, Undernet 2 or 3, Pipe Comp, Factory Comp, or Soul Silver. Wait, is the Pipe Comp in. Is it at the Dark Chip Factory? Hold on. I actually don't know where this is. Pipe pump. Did I ever even go in there? That doesn't sound familiar. At this point, I'm just gonna like, see if there's any sort of jacking spot. Anything over here? Can't go in the front doors. Nothing there. Dead end. Nothing. I missed this one. I knew something was off. Okay, pipe bomb. Now that I... Now that I'm in this section, I'm now remembering this jack and board. HP memory. Been missing that for a while. Do I? No, I don't have sneak run equipped. 
Let's see what we're finding. Not useful to me. I never get any time off. They're gonna work me until I cave in. Ugh. This pipeline takes in thermal energy from magma. But you gotta be very careful when dealing with magma. One false move and kaboom! It's all over. Indeed. Indeed. Let's see. No. I do have a lock enemy if I need it. But I can't buy another one yet. I almost want to save it. Nope, not this enemy formation. this one either. Honestly, it's starting to feel like it doesn't matter where you go. There just isn't a good enemy formation. We might just have to go with Undernet. And that's fine. It's fine if I need to use Undernet. We haven't even found the Lark enemy. I wonder if the Internet's lying to me again. Maybe it's also... Oh, you know what? It could just be a rare enemy. Yeah. Let's give it another three encounters. If I don't find it, then... Then I'll just move on to probably Undernet too. There it is. There they are. Okay, um... Let's try this. See what we can get. I need at least one double delete. I do this, get rid of the fire tiles. Come on! I just realized Scully got wasted. Yeah, that's not gonna be it. I need S. I need the S code. So it is here. But I think it's just a rare enemy type. think this is that great of a spot. Actually, if I'm going to be using my lock enemy, I better just go to Undernet, too. Because that way, I still need Shaky. I still need to fight Shaky. So, I, I could try my best at that. Maybe get them both. Hopefully. I don't know. Nothing? I'll give it another three encounters to find it again. Two more. Okay, come on. Is it here? Okay, a different enemy formation. Do I... Uh, might as well. Might as well try. I doubt I'll get a double delete, but... No double delete, and I even got hit. So, nope, that ain't it. Alright, you know what. Under it, too, it is.
in here. Okay. Untrap. Right. Off to Undernet 2. Good, I got more Zenny. I have enough for another lock enemy if I need it. I need to try. I need to try for it. However, oh, this this is gonna be tough. I can't, I need to keep the green mystery data here. Because there's a chance it could be Gunsoul. can't use this. However, we could try the charge shot. It's not water elemental. So it's not going to hurt anything. There we go. That's, that's a start. Okay, there's that. I guess we're just gonna have to go with another charge shot. There we go. Console? Mm -hmm. Fuck frags. I mean, I'll take it. I'll take it. Alright. While we're here, let me look at... Shaky 3. So we need the S code for wide shot, which means we need to get a rank nine or higher. And we have you, which we need to fight. We need to fight Shaky EX and get a rank nine or higher. And to get T, we need to fight the normal variant, or we could just buy it from Higsby's, and I think I'll do that instead. I'll buy it from. I'll buy the other one for, from Higsby's. Gonna have to money grind for that, but I. I don't remember where the level one variant is. I don't know. Or I don't. Know. We'll see. We'll see. Is this an easier fight, or do I want? The other one was the Scully. Either way, hold on. I can maybe get them both. Ah, uh, no, I didn't get them both. I, mean, I hit them both, but... No double delete. Gotta get a rank 9. Ah, oh, dang it. This ain't a rank 9. This is not a rank 9. Not even close. Get out of here. That, that was bad. That was really bad. Do I want that one? Yeah, sure. Lock enemy. Alright. Guess I'm going for that. Best route? Well, we're gonna find out. Maybe I should have gone with the other fight. Rank five, wind nose. Nope. Don't want that. Is there a green mystery data over here? Yes, what is it? Got in one. Okay, I already know I don't need that. I don't need to check over there. I'm 
there's gotta be a decent way to get get rid of him. I mean, I could throw in big noise and try to go for that. It's not the worst idea. His guardian's too weak now. And it's not electric elemental. I guess I, could, I, I guess I could throw in big noise. It's something. It's probably better than what I'm trying now. Where is it? At least that's 400 damage. I can hit them all in one shot. Where is Shade Man? We'll replace... Muramasa, that's not gonna be that helpful. And I still gotta go for the Lark enemy that's here too. Granted, I might have to leave and come back. Oh, dang it. Well, just gonna have to take what I got. Six, I got hit. I, it seems like I basically need to start with big noise. If I want to guarantee a double delete. And if I'm doing that, I might, I might as well try. I might as well try. Okay, um... I don't know how likely this is. This is not likely at all. Okay. Let's do this. not the right one. I already know that. We'll try another fight. I need the green mystery data as well. Oh, and I also need to go to Undernet 1. Let's try again, I guess. Again, not gonna be a level 9 or a double delete. Whatever I mean. Man will work. Let's see how it goes. Yep, not it. Anything? Okay, here we go again. Nope. Not on that. I think I need to go this route. Let's see if I can time it right. Nope, not even close. I don't even always know where, he, where he's going. Starting with Chaos Lord would actually do the trick too. I 
both cases, that would work. Yeah, I'm not getting any luck. Ideally, I either need to start with Big Noise, or I need to start with Chaos Lord. There is no in-between. Like, I can't think of anything else that I could do. And then that, just kind of keep going and hope I... Hit them both. With, like, fire hit. Dang it, that's not a rank 9. Other option, though. That's two out of three. There is another option. Get a counter on. Ah, uh, dang it. That was close. I was like a frame off. I was a frame off there. Right. Uh, the other option is to get a times two. Get a full sync. And... Guardian. That could work too. Uh, we're not... We're not finding anything. Wait a minute, can I... No, I'm, I'm not really gonna get it. Keep on going. Probably just hang out over here. Doesn't really matter. Alright, come on. Something useful. Okay. Let's try... them both. Fast gauge. Hit them both. It's not going to be enough. I don't think that would have been a double delete. Even if I hit them both. Dang it. Okay. Rank 7, not enough. collect on and I kind of need to keep it. Uh. I'm trying to think of what else I could do to get a double delete. There's big noise right there. Actually, maybe I could bump it back up to a rank nine. Let's see. Does it bump it back up? Rank eight. Almost. It's too bad Guardian isn't technically electrical damage. Since we're on ice tiles, maybe there is something electric base I could do. Not enough. 
I don't know if it'll hit multiple times or not, but it's not enough. Got some volts. We would have to wait on the timer. I don't know if I trust that. That's, that would only be 200 damage. I would, ha I would need at least two of them. I don't know how that would work, honestly. Anti-electric or... Wait a minute. Anti-electric. You know what? That would work better. All the shaky needs to do is just show up and attack. And then, I don't know, throw in Cloud Man, I guess. I don't know how that would help. This way, I wouldn't need to rely on like three chips to pop up at once. Because with anti-electric, it will be times two. We'll test this out right now. He hasn't moved yet. Oh, that doesn't work. That does not work. Dang it. Not even getting hit works. I'm still gonna throw in Cloud Man. See if that will help. It's not going to be that helpful for now. It was a good idea. It's just... It's just not going to work. Technically, like... Damn it. Mm. Well, I tried. Um, I don't know how Cloud Man actually works. Six. Not good enough. If I did anti wood, it won't be strong enough. Wait a minute. Hold on a minute. I want to test something. I probably didn't need to reset for that now that I'm thinking about it, but I want to test something. Oh, wait, Mud Wave. It has to be out of a hole. Uh, no. Don't have the right setup for that. Uh, Buster Rod, no. Okay. Anti Wood. 200 damage. S code. Let's get rid of Aqua World, that's fine. If I if I Tomahawk Soul and then anti wood, will I get the times two? Because grass when you're in Tomahawk Soul, if you're standing on a grass grass square. You get a times two attack for grass chips. Anti-wood is a grass chip. Then you just need to wait for him to attack. Well, we're not finding out this turn, that's for sure. Now I just want to see if it will even work. Yep. 
You know what? I'm going to leave it like this. Because I, I really want to test that out. Uh, what can I get rid of? GG. There we go. Yeah, at this point, I want to test out and see if that plan will even work. It would still require two chips. And we still have big noise as an option. Um, no, not that. I don't want to go Tomahawk Soul just yet. Colonel? Yeah, we can get rid of this. It's not a big deal. Yeah, sometimes with getting these chips, you just need the right combo. Actually, I'm not even going for... Her. I'm not even going to go for this. Okay, come on. Shadow Man, that's not right. Not what I need. Get rid of more stuff. It's too bad I won't be able to put anti-wood on the shortcut. Okay, here it is. Let's test this out. Tomahawk. There is no times two. I had a feeling it wouldn't work. Wait, how come that didn't work? That didn't activate. Wait, it went away. That's... Okay, whatever. Not, not gonna work. No matter how you look at it, it's not gonna work. Uh, I'm gonna step away for just a second. Uh, be right back.
Alright, I'm back. This one back. There we go. And you know, it might have been fights like uh, fights like this where I didn't complete the program in advance because of similar reasons like this. Anti wood doesn't work. I don't know what I am supposed to do. And even then, this won't double delete, but oh well. Yeah. What is the best way to get... What is the best way to get a double delete on them? Maybe I need to look at uh, wood chips instead of electric ones, even though electric ones is probably the, the way to go. Is there anything that can just hit all of them? I think that's gonna help. Yo yo, no. Drill arm, no. I don't have the right setup. Air hockey, no. Too weak. Scully doesn't work. Air I don't know how many times that attacks. It's probably not gonna be enough. Hot body, pro. That would be 300. That would be 300 damage. I don't know how the chip actually works, but. It's more than fire hit. It says burns em enemies all around. I could try custom volt three. And just, if custom volt one is already 110 damage at max, custom volt three would have to deal 150 for the electric one, and even more. Can I get a, I'm not getting a listing. Oh wait, uh, yeah, custom volt three at max 150. It's not enough for a double delete. It's not enough for a double delete. But I think we could throw in like a plus 10 or a plus 30. Something like that. Burmarine's too weak. Asteroid's too random. This is not going to work. Volts? What about volts? Can I get a description on here? No, not really. Branch grows out from sides. It would one hit KO. It would one hit KO the electric shaky, but not the wood enemy. It's not worth it. It's so funny that you get these in a different order, but Red Wave deals more damage than Mud Wave. Yet Mud Wave has gotten after. Time bomb program advance, but you wouldn't nah. Boy bomb still not strong enough. Mines? No. It's too risky. I just don't know what to do. None of these work. These don't work. Wood attack damages you. Mm. Um. No. 
even if Neovari did three shock wave, well, it would have to deal three shock waves, but I don't think that. I don't think it does anymore. Yeah, I think I don't think it does. No. Number, number ball. What's my current HP at? No, that is nowhere near close. Um. Super Vulcan won't stun. No, that's not gonna work. Jealousy. No. Bug fix. No. I don't know. If that's not gonna help. Oh my god. Not strong enough. This is not strong enough. Even if I did a plus 30, it's not enough. I would have to go Nightman in this. Am I winning? Twitch been acting up for you? Well, been working on program advances, Hot Corn Dog, but I'm trying to get a new chip and it's just not, not working out. I'm having trouble getting a new chip, so it's hard to say. Let's see, this enemy right here. Uh, we need to get the Shaky EX enemy, but the problem is I just can't deal enough damage. And ideally, if I could get a double delete, that would be better. But that's not going to happen. Oh, come on. I was like two chips off. One or two chips off. This was one of the plants. Let's see if I can... Let's see if it's enough. It's not. So let's see. Yeah, it's a rank seven. That wouldn't have been it. So right now, I'm just kind of stumped on what to do. Because none of these are really going to help me. I almost, I basically need a time stop. And ideally, if I could get a times two. But not a times two. Uh, a, an, um, yeah, I don't know. Wild Bird could work. I could time it right. You're playing God of War 1, and how's that going for you? Is it a first playthrough or just replaying it? I could throw in Wild Bird 2. That's another option. If it hits multiple times, then if it at least hits it hits them twice, it would work. Three times. Hits him three times. I could throw in Wild Bird. I don't really have much of an option. Like, I don't have many ways to get through this. I need... No, not Slasher. Katana. What can I ever give her? Aqua World, sure. Lark man. Replace Shadow. Ugh, fine. I'm just kinda stumped on what to do. Yeah, hot corn dog, I've been just focusing on getting the Program Vance is done. Or as far as I can. But right now, this one, I'm not sure. Maybe there's a different enemy formation that would be easier. But I don't know what that would be. For now, though, this is still not a good one. I got a double delete. Rank nine, wrong chip. 
Uh, just when I get a rank 9, it was the other virus. Okay. Um, no, I can't really efficiently do this fight. Anti-water could probably work on that one, or anti-electric. Actually, with that particular formation, you could use anti-electric, and I think you can actually make it work. So that would be a strategy if I need to find that particular formation. Or, well, anti-water won't help, but... Uh, like, nothing here really helps. Oh yeah, how's God of War 1 going for ya? Not gonna be expired. It's your first playthrough, but not really. PS2 copy always froze at one point. I decided to try the PlayStation Plus video, which I lost in the stream old games from the PSC area. HD remastered for PS3, so the first game. I see, I see. So, okay, look. The Guardian would work, but it's technically not electric. Oh, it's, okay. It's technically not electric anymore. So, look. If I do this. That would have worked if it would have worked if it wasn't for it's not electrical anymore. Larkman, I mean, sure, I guess. It's two squares ahead. Okay. Larkman SP. Is it a rank 9? It is a rank 10. That's the code? I think that's the code. I think that's it. Well, I'm, I'm double checking. Uh, da, da, da. Where is it? Where is it? Uh, is it really this far up? No, it's not this far up. Where is the shaky? Where's the spin shake? Uh, da on time bomb. Lance, wood nose, gold spills. Okay, there we go. That was the S code. That is right. The T code we're going to buy. So we're done there. I'm putting my folder back how it was. The pack slash gameplay is still doing the puzzle solving. Very nice. I still haven't played any God of War stuff. I need to one of these days. I know, like, the older God of Wars is, like, something that's hard to stream because, you know, the, uh, you know, you know, the, uh, the, the sexy bits that you can do with Kratos, you know, and then the, the ladies, right? That 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 would eat instantly get you tank take down, I think. Uh, I had long blades. That's right. All right. Set this back up. I need to check area one. for green mystery data. I don't know where it is. Oh, there's one. Zenny, okay. 
nothing there. Okay. We'll take it. Guardian. I'm probably going to get a hit out because of this. That's okay. The green mystery data is safe for now. I did say for now. Let's try it. Scully 3! No, that wouldn't have worked anyway. Green mystery data was not safe. Which I didn't need it to be. Uh, okay. Right. Go up and around. Let's just start from the beginning. Yeah, I know God of War is a... Uh, the older ones are kind of hard to play on stream because, you know, Twitch is just like, no, we don't like that. At least that's what I hear. Where's the other green? I'm gonna run from this. Oh. Uh, Subchip dealer. Actually, can I buy? Yeah, I need another lock enemy. Gonna need that. Nothing here. Oh yeah, hot corn dog. On my own time, I was playing Pokey Rogue, right? And this Spearow that I got, it is a monster. Or it can be once you build it up. You know, early game is kind of tricky, but once you build it up enough. This Spearow is now a monster. It's not perfect yet. Yet. Bug Bomb A. That was what I was looking for. Now we can do another program advanced with that. Okay. We need to buy the chips for these two. We need to buy... No. We need to buy this chip. Well, we don't need to, but it'll... We got a hunt for this one. Four. Um, and five is five is poison pharaoh, and then we need okay, okay. A lot of boobs and blood. Exactly, exactly. But yeah, the spearow I got is a monster, <laughs> or it can be. Uh. So, I, I randomly caught its hit ability early on, which is Sniper, which, if it gets a crit, it does, the, the, the crit damage is even more than what it normally is, right? It naturally levels up and gets Focus Energy at some point. Focus Energy... Uh, focus Energy increases your chances of getting a crit. And it's almost guaranteed at that point, honestly. Not only that, uh, if you manage to get uh, basically a move tutor, or move relearner, I should say, within one of the item drops, you can, once you have Firo, you can get Drill Run, which is a ground type move, covers its, covers its electric weakness. And not only that, not only does it cover its electric weakness, it has a higher chance to crit. It does have a 10% chance to miss, but, you know, it works out most of the time. And not only that, I got enough of uh, Spiro candy uh, pulled together to get its passive ability, which is Moxie. And Moxie increases your attack power for every KO you manage to get. Firo is a monster. <laughs> and it also has Roost to heal itself. So that's basically all I need. No drill Peck, Drill Run, Focus Energy, and Roost for healing. 
give Firo a, time, a little bit of time to set up and he, he can't be stopped. So right now we're looking for the Lark enemy. And there's a specific enemy formation that I kind of want to get into. Not this one. Not this formation. If I scully, that's not going to be enough. Yeah, the Tark here is what I'm looking for, but not this formation. This is fun to use. Guardian. I that was timed perfectly. Not the whirl. Right enemy, wrong formation. We're trying that again. And you know what? Because I already know the formation that I want. Uh, I am looking for anti-electric. Let me just do this. Because if we could get anti-electric at the very start, I think we could get a double. This is the formation. Here we go. This is what we want. Um... At, the, at this point, I just want to win the fight. I just want to win the fight at the moment. Barkman SP. There's that. One more. Come on. Fine, be that way. Either, either way, we found the formation. That's what really matters right now. Again, that's not the right code. Alright. Lock enemy. Okay. Alright, made a save. We need to start with anti-electric. Because we are looking for only a single chip, we can maybe make it work. Okay, it doesn't... Well, we didn't start with it, but let's see if uh, it's in the next set. There it is. Electric. Come on. Go in the front. See, that would work. But the guy in the back was hanging out back there. That didn't work. That's the right idea, though. If he was hanging out in the front or the middle column, he would have taken even more damage because hovering over ice. So that's the strategy. And it doesn't work on this enemy. I tried it on Shaky. It doesn't work on him. I was really upset. It would have worked instantly. <coughs> but no. He's always electric. So that's cheating. He's always in attack mode. Okay. No luck. No luck. this point, uh, I guess we'll go here. Get rid of you. Yeah, go ahead, hang out on the back.
kind of sucks that we're relying on a strategy where it's a single chip on turn one. Not the best idea, but that's what save and resets are for. But right now, like, whenever I play Pokey Rogue, I'm like, you know what? I'll play a round, that won't take that long, and then... Of course, that's the round where you get a very good run. And once you get a very good run, it's very hard to stop. Great. I'm not, I'm not doing so well. Rank 9? Okay. Wrong one. We need a rank 9, but... We got the other chip. Of course we did. Ugh. Nope. Not this one. I am not dealing with this. justify this fight, can I? I mean, like, that's not enough to kill the first guy. No. No, I don't think I can make it. I don't think I can get a rank 9. I don't think so. Be hard to pull off. Actually, well... You know what? I probably could have now that I think about it. Oh, not this fight. I don't need to fight you. I could have just ran. Oh, well. Here we go. Anti-electric. Can we start with it? As long as he stays in the front, too. What? That doesn't work? That... <sighs> it should have worked. It should have worked. That's dumb. Okay. Then... Different plan? Different plan. Uh, not false. Where is it? No, too far, too far. 200... Hmm... I could throw in shakies. However, let's try Custom Volts. Custom Volt at max will deal 150 damage. Maybe I can hit him. Maybe they can hit multiple times if they move? Larkman, I don't, I don't want to fight you. I don't. I, I really don't. Actually, did I... I did... Okay, no, I need to fix it again. Just when you think you have a strategy that's gonna work, the game's like, no. We're not allowed... We thought of that. We thought you'd try that. We're not allowing that. Custom Volts. At max, it can deal 150. They're hovering over ice. That's times two. And that should work in this case. And maybe we can hit them twice if they move. Maybe? I don't know. 
honestly. I can't think of another strategy right now. Granted, we only need a rank 9, but... Come on. Um, what's the best thing to do? Kinda needed one at that time to bump it up, but no. You see, I'm not sure what else I could do to make this work. I guess I should throw in big noise back in if I took it out already. It's not the worst idea. Toad Man is not going to help me. I could turp Toad Soul, but I'm not. Maybe I should have. Maybe I should have Toad Soul. Oh, well. Trying to think what else I could go with. Yeah, I could throw in big noise back in. I could throw in the super, the super bird move, whatever that is. Mm. No, I, I gotta try. I gotta. I gotta at least try. chips. If I work fast enough. Okay. Custom bolt? And we'll find out if this would have worked. damage was he even at? How much damage was I supposed to do? I know it wasn't at max, but... No, I'm not gonna fight you. Molly, what are you doing? Not this fight. Yeah, I am not sure. I am not sure right now. Okay, a lot of stuff doesn't work. Um... Wait, let's start with this. We could use these two. I got hit. You know what? Hold on. Let me look at my folder again. Yeah, okay. You know what? I need to have the chance of the two program advances. Where's Katana? I need to have the chance. Mm. 
Those might be my best shots. Because I don't know what else to do. Well, I mean, I could try this. If I go here, this 170 times 2. Hmm. Hold on. 10 damage. Is that rank 9? Rank 7. Took way too long. See? Like, I was 10 seconds off. I was 10 seconds off. Like, I needed, like, one more attack power in that fire chip. Just one more would have worked. Okay. Since I'm not relying on electricity, or to do double damage with ice... Rank 7. Not fast enough. Charge shot's too slow. Charge shot's too slow. You need it under 5 seconds. And what can I do? What can I do? I guess just... Just keep going and hope I start with big noise. That is literally waiting for three chips, though. Unless I put one of the pulsars on the shortcuts to guarantee it. Then I gotta hope for two others. I feel like that getting like higher ranking chips in or higher ranking uh you know getting double kills on these is a lot harder than in like battle network three they are not gonna line up however we can start with leader raid Get this guy KO'd. My chart shot failed because I timed it wrong, but not only that, it would have activated anti-electric. Rank 7. See? Not good enough. Oh, what to do? Toadman Aqua Whirl. Toadman and Aqua Whirl combined. Get two Aqua Whirls from the star and you charge them both up. That would work. Possibly. Oh, I didn't know this formation existed. Or forgot about this one, however you want to phrase it. Larkman's not gonna work. I can... Mm, I can at least maybe get the green mystery data. Anti-electric, that wasted a, that wastes a move. It's Zenny. I was hoping for Gunsoul. If it was Gunsoul, I would have kept it. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? Uh, no, 
not enough. If I do this... And set this up, maybe? I don't know. I don't know what to do. This cage. Lark man. I'm not saying there's a chance for a double delete. And it's ranked nine. It was rank nine, but it was the wrong code. We needed S. Riggs in the chat. It's rigged. Alright. Okay. Might as well just try for... Oh, nope. That was a one hit kill. Alright. Well, this ain't happening. Enemy expired. All right, try that again. Okay. If Maybe I can make this work. With fire hits. Do that. Oh no, I got hit. This ain't, this ain't gonna happen. Double delete. Rank 8. It might have worked if I did not get hit. Like, fire hit is not the worst idea, but the problem is they both have to line up. It doesn't guarantee it. You see, like, I have chips in here and some strategies that can get, get it to work. But the nature of Battle Network is you gotta hope that you start off with the chips you want. Hell, if we started off with Chaos Lord, that would solve all of our problems. Okay, you know what? L, M, and N, Program of Advance. Cactus Dance 3. That is something. It's not. I'm not guaranteeing this, but... See, you didn't guarantee. How... However... This works in my favor. I need to keep this. We're just going to Mega Buster. I don't care. I am keeping this. I am at times two right now. I am at times two. So now, what do I want to try? Honestly, I the strategy now I think feel like is going for Guardian. If I can start with Guardian, then I can definitely get the double delete. And that might be enough. However, it's not going to happen all the time, is it? Hmm. Let's 
at this point I'll just try for it, but... Anti-damage. This should get me the rank 9. Are you kidding me? Oh, it would have gotten me the rank 9, but no, he moves too quickly. No, I gotta reset that. That was dumb. Note to self, if I'm using anti-damage, make sure it's used on the other one. I gotta go for the rank 9 now. Alright. Let's hope. Rank 9. Rank 7. I still have the times 2 so I can keep going. really need I need like guardian or big noise cactus stance one didn't help times two that's 280 times two 380 hold on that might work they have to line up they can only do that in the front. Never mind. I might... There could have been a chance... If I destroyed the green mystery data myself. Kratos is coming to be violent in those old games. I, yeah, I, I hear he is! I, are you kidding me? In the fight where it doesn't matter, I start with Guardian. The fight where it does not matter. Thanks, game. The game's just mocking me now. It's just like, oh, you need Guardian at the start of the fight? Well, here you go. I'll be like, thanks, game. Not the fight, though, that I actually needed. Thanks. I gotta try now. Rank 5, please. Rank 5. Rank 9. Damn it. Nope. Not gonna work. <sighs> hmm. What if I get rid of anti navy and. I bet there's something else I could get rid of. Throw in another Aqua Whirl back in? I don't know. No, I don't want to leave. Not the fight that I want. However, can I get a rank 9 out of this? Is there any way I could get a rank 9? Maybe I could double delete. Double delete. Rank nine. Rigs in the chat. Wrong code. The wrong code. The game is mocking me. Yep.
maybe I could have made that work if I... Uh, I don't know. No, not this one. Not this fight. Ugh. I really want to know what program advance I was missing on my original file. I really need to look it up. Because it's got to be stu something stupid like this. Okay. I got hit, but I got the double delete. Rank 10. It's all because I got hit. It's dumb that you could get this at a rank 10. Dark Toad Man twice works too. I just have to have good timing. Okay, here we go. We have Guardian. We have Invis. So I am completely safe. That was all the other worry, honestly. I am completely safe from harm. Get wrecked, please. What the S rank. Oh my god. The game's mocking me. That was two times. That was two times I could have gotten the chip. But no. The game's just not letting me have it. The time where I actually get Guardian to start with. No, none of that. Shame on you. Good day, sir. Go back to start. Okay. I'm not gonna get the... Is it rank 9? Or is it too late? Yeah, it's too late. I needed, like, another chip to really make that work. If I had a second Scully, that would have worked. Playing one. It really does feel like it was gonna be. Yeah, most first games and franchises don't necessarily expect to get a sequel. Let's try this again. Okay, wait, I have two options here. I could use the Guardian. Or I could go Dark Toad Man. I have to be able to dodge. Okay. Ah, dang it. Rank 10. Rank 9. Wrong code. Maybe I could have hung out front, I don't know. That one I could have probably done better. Alright, Dark Toad Man it is. We got another shot. Okay. Attack. Okay, that's not gonna work. That's on me. That's on me. And I, I did not get my timing right. Yeah, I would say most games and franchises don't expect to get sequels, so they kind of make them stand alone. And then they get sequels, and then they go overboard. Kingdom Hearts is a prime example of that.
Granted, Kingdom Hearts, like, obviously had a sequel set up with that ending. But it's clear it was like they didn't ex act fully know if they were. Although it was Square Enix. They probably expected it. I don't know. Ugh. I need to give this, like... I don't have much more time. No, not this fight. Was the Guardian in there? I can I didn't see. Oh well. I need another I, I feel like I need I, I feel like I only have one more good attempt in me. Not this fight. Lock enemy expired. Let's try that again. Okay, come on. Okay, what do we got? Leader Raid would deal 400 damage. I think we might have another shot. Total of 800 for the one guy in front. Rank S, finally. I did say I had one more in me. We did it. We got one of the chips I need for a program advance. Let's go activate some program advances, see what I got, and then we'll see what we have left and then go from there. That took forever. That, that just took forever. Okay, what do I got? Let's activate some program advances. I don't have those, don't have those. Wide shot, shake parade, and I think, uh, poison pharaoh. Yeah, that sounds right. Let's get these done. Five shots. I only have one katana in here? Did I mess up? Oh well. Okay, hold on. Uh, shake parade. Shake parade. There we go. Oh, right. I need to buy the other chip. I actually can't. That's fine. Uh, Poison Pharaoh. Bug Bomb. Bug Bomb A. I also need... Here, let's get rid of a Scully, I guess. Geddon. I need Geddon. Where is it? Then 3A. And then I need Anubis. We'll get rid of Larkman. Swapping Shade Man back with Shadow. Because I'm not going for big noise anymore. Let's go. Alright, I could do two program advances right now. I thought I had three, but no, I gotta buy the other chip. That's fine. I'm okay with that. See what we get first. And we'll just leave it be. We got Bug Bomb. Alright. Number Soul. I thought we'd be able to get all the program advances done today, but that's not happening. We're getting close, though. Okay, that's two each. Not enough. Come on. Yeah, let's give it a pack. Well, 
on, just one more chip. Doesn't matter which one. Let's pick one. Okay. Let's get rid of these, I guess. Uh, yeah. Doesn't really matter. Program with uh, Tomahawk Man. Get rid of another chip. It's gonna be a little bit. Get rid of, get rid of that. Doesn't really matter which one, just get rid of one. Yeah, I completely forgot Time Two Lear Raid would have done it. Like, I didn't even think about that. No, no, it makes sense. Makes perfect sense. And to think, normally you wouldn't have Leader Raid because it was a download ship. Just gave me another option. S T U. Program Advance. Super Spread 3. 140 damage per hit. Shoots three of them. Soon not enough. I only jumped it up to plus 50. Weird. Bug Bomb. Get in 3. Anubis. Program Advance, Poison Pharaoh. Still as good as it ever was. Okay. With that in mind, we have four program advances to get. M Cannon, the other one I think we buy with money. Infinite Super Vulcan 3, we buy with money. That's two. We buy the third one with money. And then we need two Gunsoul D 3Ds, which we could get from Green Mystery Data in Undernet. And we can also buy the other one if we need to. So, with that in mind. Let me put my folder back. We don't need... We don't need collect. I think we are completely done with collect. Like, I don't think we need it at all. We don't need it all. I'm gonna put my folder back to where it was. Alright, I am missing two Aqua Whirls and I'm missing a Scully. Where's Scully? That. Two Aqua Whirls. And I am missing. There's two chips here. It is. I had. I had these two. Alright. I think my folder is back to normal, how it was. This, this is uh, Muramasa. Where is it? Where are you? There you go. Yeah, this this looks right. This looks correct. All right. And with that, I am wrapping things up right now. Thanks for everyone who showed up doing these streams Monday through Friday at noon Pacific time. If you want to see the old streams that are not on Twitch anymore, they're on YouTube at scottbot 64 Stream Archives. Next time, the plan is to get the other four program advances done. Then we can open one of the doors in Nebula Area 4. Then we need to Navi Hunt. 
I'm thinking on my off time, if I have a moment, I will... I think I'll spend some time bug frag grinding slash getting some extra money in Nebula area. Try to get some of that done off screen. Still need a lot of bug fragments. Anyway, I think that sounds about right. Have a good day. Later.